Hey guys, it's Yara. Um, today I'm going to be doing a rant video, which I know I usually don't do, but I just need to do this. So if you don't want to watch it, click any of my other videos, check them out, and yeah. Okay, so today... I, I just got back now, basically, within an hour. Today, I went to go take my road test for the second time. And the first time, the lady, like, just hated her life. And she was just calling calling out stuff that had made no sense at all. Like, I don't even know. I don't even, I don't even know. It was just the worst experience of my life. And she was, like, she was gross. She, um got in my car it was raining she got in my car she like threw her jacket on my seats in my car and like I don't know it was it was bad and she was just all over the place she's like wiping her feet all over and like touching everything and I was just like okay this is ridiculous so anyway hold on I gotta sneeze I guess not. but so um Today, I went, and I was, I went to, like, this driving school thing that they have where I live, and, um, you practice for two hours, and then you go out, and you take your test. <sighs> Sorry, I'm, my allergies are killing me, so that's why I sound weird, or I can't breathe, that's why. <sighs> but anyway, so I went out for two hours, and they were like, there's no doubt you're gonna pass, you're doing amazing, blah, blah, blah. On Sunday, I went, and they were, the guy was like, you're doing like freaking awesome like there's nothing wrong there's no reason why you can't be driving blah 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 and then I go to my driving test and this lady gets my car and she's like where's your papers I'm like right here I left them right in front for you like okay and then and then she seemed nice cause she was like I'm not gonna like you know I'm just gonna tell you what you're doing wrong just try to fix it you know you're not in trouble and I was like okay like sorry about that and then we start driving, um, and to pull away from the curb, I put my directional on, turn my wheel, look at my mirrors, and look, check my blind spot, and go. And then, she tells me, oh, you didn't check your mirrors. So I was like, okay, even though I did, and then I checked my blind spot, but I didn't want to argue, and then she's going to get pissed, and then definitely fail me, because I thought I would have a good chance of passing. So, I was like, whatever, okay. Um, and then on my little slip that I get, she tells me that... I used my mirrors, but I didn't check my blind spot when I pulled away. So I'm pretty sure she just tried to give me some points off because she didn't even write the right thing. And I, that didn't happen because she saw me looking like 90 million times. Anyway, and then we're driving down the road and she literally is retarded. Like, excuse me, but she's fucking retarded. Okay, let's say this is the end of the road, right? And my car's coming along the road and there's like a, a road here and a road here. I'm driving along, and, you know, like, when you get to about here, maybe you'd want to say, okay, yeah, but the next thing you're going to turn left. No. She, I'm driving like this. I get to about here. She's like, turn left here, turn here, here. And I'm like, all right. So I put my blinker on and, like, quickly turn. She's like, you cut that turn short. Well, of course I cut the tur turn short, you fucking bitch, because th there's no room for me to go. The road was here and here. And you're like, oh, turn. So I'm trying to cut it in so that I don't, like, go up onto the curb. So for every turn, she did that. And then, there's a car parked here along the road, and I was, like, wondering, huh, I wonder if I'm going to parallel park against that. But she just, like, keep going straight past the car. So I was, like, okay. So I'm driving straight. I literally get to, like, here, and she's, like, oh, I'm at parallel park against the car. So I'm, like, err, and stop the car. I parallel park. She's, like, that was good. And then, you know when you parallel park, you usually, like, you end up back here, and then you pull forward and park? No. She, I pulled all the way in, whatever, I was like here, and then I went to put it in drive to pull forward, like I learned in every driving thing I took, and she's like, why would you do that? I was like, because I'm like back here. She's like, no, you don't pull forward. Like, that's weird, because I do it every other time. And so then I was like, oh, okay, that's just how I was taught to do it, so sorry. She's like, you're already close enough. It's like, okay, like, shut the fuck up. And then... Um, she goes, okay, you can go out now. So I put my blinker on, turn it, you know, put it in drive, look over my shoulder, and I'm about to go. And she's like, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm turning out. She's like, what are you supposed to do? I'm like, put my direction on, check over my shoulder, turn the wheel, go, like, check my blind spot. What do you want me to do? She's like, you didn't reverse. I'm like, but I didn't pull forward, so why do I have to reverse? She's like, you have to reverse to get out. It's like... Okay, so then I put it in reverse, reverse even more, 
and turned, blah, 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 and got out. So I was already like, what the hell are you telling me? Because every other time I take my driving thing, it's like, here, here, you just go back, and then you pull forward so you're close, and then to get out, you reverse, whatever, and go out. So that was all wrong. I can't, I was coming down the road, and there was cars on either side of the road, of course, and there was a car coming, so I was slowing down. She's like, you need to stop. And I was like, okay. So I stopped, and then she's like, move over more to the cars. Then I moved over, and she's like, you're too close to the car. So I was like, okay, where am I supposed to go then? What are you saying to me? And then again, she's like, you're cutting your turns too close. Well, yeah, because you're telling me at the last second. Like, you can't tell me right as the turn's like, I'm passing it. I'll turn here. Like, oh, my God. So mad. And, oh, my God. I... I don't even know. My three-point turns and my yellow parking were fine, except for, like, that weird thing. But, and then she gave me 80 points. She literally marked every single thing on that machine. And nothing of that happened. She said I almost got into an accident. She said she had to use my, the brake, even though there's not a brake in the car. So, I don't know what she's talking about. She said I was speeding, which I was barely moving because there's so much damn, like, cars all over the fucking place. I was, like, rolling down the road like I barely touched the gas so I was speeding in a 30 mile an hour zone I was speeding at five miles an hour like literally I was going five miles an hour um I don't even know my turns and some other shit but I am just furious because this is the second time the first lady screwed me over this lady screwed me over like are you fucking kidding me and every time I go they're like you're you drive perfect there's no neat reason why you shouldn't pass but yet, I fail every time. And I don't understand how there's people on the fucking road that are driving like they're fucking blind in both eyes. And they can't see shit. But they can pass. And they drive all over the fucking place and, like, kill people. But that's okay because, you know, they already passed. So, good thing for them. But somebody that actually cares about other people that are driving and, like, concerned about their driving cannot pass. And another thing I don't understand. If you took driver's ed, comment below. Don't you think that if you took driver's ed, they should be able to pass you and give you your license because you spend five minutes in the car with someone that's giving you your road test they don't know how you drive they just know you from the five minutes and they're making you do like a little retarded course somebody that you drive with for weeks months should be able to judge whether you're a good driver or you're a bad driver and they should be able to give you your license or like recommend you for your license or something i don't understand how you why can't they give you your license like why can't we change that why can't we make that a law? If you take driver's ed and your driving instructor can pass you, then you pass. I don't understand why I took driver's ed and I took two courses, like, outside of driver's ed. And I still failed because they, they're like, oh, you're nervous. Okay, if I'm nervous, then you'd understand. But I am confused. I don't know what's happening. So, yeah. So, leave comments below of what you think. If you failed your road test, leave it below. If you pass, lucky you. Leave it below. But... I'm done. I came home and just cried, and I was like, what the fuck, man? Like, how are you going to fail me, and I'm not even doing anything wrong? So, I don't know. My friend last week, he passed. He almost hit somebody. He was speeding 20, 20 miles over the speed limit and hit the curb parallel parking and three-point turn and still passed. Oh, my God. And so many people have that story. Like, oh, yeah, I did really well. I did really bad, but I passed. I, I, I was speeding, blah, 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 but I passed. All right, nothing happened that somebody was going to die today, but I still failed. So I'm just a little bit pissed. Leave your comments below telling me what you think about this. And I hope I'm not the only one out there. So, yeah, I'm taking mine on Monday again, so I'll let you guys know how that goes. Follow me on Twitter, link below if you want to find out, whatever. But I'm going to go and punch myself in the face. So see you guys next time. Bye.